Six. Seven. Thirteen. Nineteen. Twenty-four. Well, that was a good shot from uh, Jimmy, but he was short on the blue, that's why he had to force the cue ball right around the table. 25. Played that with uh, Stone and a lot of right hand side. So, a chance here for Cliff. One. Seven. Cliff really running out of position from a comparatively simple red. Green ball. Auburn and Thorne, eight. inspired Higgins pot. Higgins and White, one. Well, I don't think this couple will start taking too many chances, but that could be the One. danger to them, if, if there is a danger, that they relax too much. <coughs> Six. 
7. Eight. <coughs> Thorburn and Thorn. Eight. Quiet, please. See what Cliff thought about that. The cue nearly got the treatment. Really was a careless one. One. Alex tried to. Uh disturb the Five. two reds which are lying together with the first red the potted and he'll probably try and do it again here. Six. Looks perfect. Thirteen. Twenty-one. Just looking at the scoreboard there, but this red and another colour will certainly give 22. the title to Higgins and White. Twenty-five. Twenty-seven. Well, Alex and Jimmy were second favourites before the tournament started. And once 30. they knocked the favourites, Davis and Mio out yesterday. They've certainly justified the bookmaker's rating. And I think 34. on balance, they've played the best snooker of the last ten days consistently. And if they stay together next year, I think they're going to take a bit of shift feet. Yeah. So that's it. Alex Higgins and Jimmy White winning the 1984 Hopmeister World Doubles, beating Cliff Corbin and Willie Thorn by 10 frames to 2. And as you can hear from the crowd, of the most popular victory. That audience really appreciates it. For well, that's the reward, a magnificent trophy to go with the title, the gold medals, and the first prize of 34,500 pounds. As you can see, their supporters ecstatic at the pair success.